What was that soup you made for supper last night? Oh, that? That's a traditional Ferelden lamb and pea stew. Do you like it? This video is sponsored by absolutely no one. Hello and welcome to Press F for Food. For traditional Ferelden lamb and pea stew, there are two ways you can go about it. If you want to make it using bought or already prepared stock, you may skip to this timestamp and use any fast cooking cut of lamb. If you want to make the stock yourself, like I am in this video, you can either use shoulder or leg of lamb, just make sure you leave the bone in. At the advice of my local butcher, I chose to go with ribs, since all the bones will give a wonderful broth and the meat will simply melt in your mouth. Begin by sweating off a large diced onion until it turns translucent. Add your roughly chopped carrots and fry for a few minutes. Then place in your chosen cut of lamb and fill with water until your lamb is just covered. Add two bay leaves, some whole peppercorns and a handful of parsley, stalks and all. Bring it to a boil, then cover with a lid and let it simmer on a low heat for three hours. Take off the heat and then pour the contents into a colander placed in a large bowl. Discard the onions, carrots and parsley. Place your lamb in a bowl and let it cool down to a temperature that allows you to handle it, so you can separate the meat from the bones and connective tissue. Once that is done, again sweat off a large onion in a dish suitable to hold large amounts of ingredients. Add your carrots and stir them around for a bit. And now, a quick message from the partner of this video. Bumping into your tripod. Shagging your camera angle since the invention of tripods. Sift a couple tablespoons of flour onto your vegetables and coat them evenly. Let it brown for a moment and then deglaze with your stock. You can freeze the rest if you want for another time once it's cooled down. Bring it to a boil, then turn down to medium-low heat and add your mushrooms, your potatoes, another two bay leaves, generous amounts of black pepper and more salt than you can find at an esports event. If you used pre-made stock, this is also the time to add your lamb. Cover and let it simmer for about half an hour. With 10 minutes still to go, add your peas. Fresh or frozen is up to you. Also generous amounts of chopped parsley. Cover again and finish the simmer. If you use prepared stock, take out your lamb and separate the meat from the bones, then put it back into the dish. Serve with some more parsley, some good and even red wine and sourdough bread. I apologize for the slightly skewed camera angle. Ingredients are down below the sub button. Let me know what you think if you make some yourself. Coming out with me on Twitter and Instagram. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. And until then, have a good one.